Okay, uh, as you can see here, there's a plate. Duh. And there's more dishes on it. Um, I do this a couple times a day. Uh, usually like this. So there'll be only one kind of fruit or one kind of vegetable in it. Um, I generally give them one fruit and one vegetable a day plus a dairy. Um, the dairy is not 100% every single day. Uh, dairy usually is only cheese. That's the only thing I give them. And shredded cheese. I used to give them cube cheese, but it was a little more of a serving than I would like. Because um, they don't eat very much. Their stomachs are really tiny, you know. It's about the size of a snow pea. You know? So you really don't want to fill it all up with crap. It doesn't matter how good the crap is, right? So, um, this this is extra now because I never used to have to do that. But this is for mocha latte. Uh, as you can see, this is not uh, half a cup, okay? Because she also gets vegetables. So, she doesn't need a whole half a cup of strawberries. I could give her it, but... Um, this is actually the only... It looks like a lot, but it's actually only one giant jumbo strawberry. This is how much I got out of it. Um, so, there's a two... Some of them have more. This is for my loners, um, like Sniffles and Nibbles, my winter whites that are single in a cage. They only get one piece. Um, this is for somebody like Snowball and Patches, which are in a group of two, or my Campbells. Uh, they get fruit too. Um, they get everything everyone else gets. I don't care about the diabetes part. I just rather give them less often or not a big portion. Um, so like if these guys finished it and they wanted more and they were sniffing the bowl, I might give them another piece, but I wouldn't give the Campbell's a second piece. So, you know, everybody does get some. And then this one, you'll notice that there's five pieces. I, my, most of my hamster cages have one or two. There's only four hamsters that are going to be eating this. And the reason there's five is in case somebody finishes and then they start fighting. I usually add one more piece or somebody might have taken one and then lost grip of it and it fell out and before I could even put it back in somebody else was looking for their piece and there was none and I don't want them to fight that's why there's five pieces but this the robos are really good they don't fight and they don't um, like they don't all go after their food at the same time they're not hoarders at all they don't care uh, they just eat it at their leisure and sometimes this stuff will sit there for about an hour before somebody comes by and takes one okay so it's not a big deal but I just don't want anyone fighting and the robos have no risk of diabetes, so it's okay. Um, but they have small pieces too, as you can see. So yeah, it usually balances out. And at the end of the day, usually I find half-eaten pieces. So um, that means this is actually more than they can eat. This is approximately half a sugar cube. Of, um, actually, no. This is almost one sugar cube, actually. But they don't eat it all. That's what I mean by giving them only half to quarter of a sugar cube size of vegetables or fruit at a time. Because they actually don't eat very much. Okay, so um, some of my hamsters have had strawberries, I believe. Um, I think. Yeah. Um, with the exception of uh, mocha latte. And she was squeaking earlier because she's she smelled it, I bet. <laughs> I don't know if she's ever had it, but I'm pretty sure in the pet shop that I got it from would definitely not be bothered to give her this stuff so um just to keep her from hiding in her igloo and being a, you know a lonely sulking little guinea pig um she's gonna we put this in front of her nose and then I'm gonna put it over here and then we're gonna just sit here and see if she'll go and check out the new stuff because she's never had it don't tell me you're scared of a strawberry don't tell me you're scared of strawberries, girl. Hmm? Hmm? Here you go. Surprise! Alright, now that all your hiding spots are gone, what are you going to do? <laughs> you go try out the straw. I want to capture that. Um, I like to capture a lot of things on video. Um, but in this case, the... Strawberry thing looks really cute. You have fresh strawberries over there, and you're only going to have some hay? Well, that's boring. We don't want to watch that. We can watch you eat hay anytime. I don't always buy strawberries, actually. Um, I'm more of a banana watermelon person. <laughs> Alright, well, she's boring. <laughs> And so, um, well, this is one of the reasons I really like bin cages. Look at that. Because of the nice corners. So I can just leave it like that. And I usually do. Okay, so I'm going to actually be 
This may sound a little mean, but I actually look for the smallest pieces of fruit. Um, that's usually the Campbell's, because I don't want them overeating. But even so, it's humongous. So it's not like I'm depriving them. It's just, you know. So let's see if I can get Baby to do it. Hey, Baby. You're not interested. But you can't eat it in the bowl, because I don't want the strawberry in the bowl. Thank you. Look at that thing. It's bigger than he is. All right, Grouch. This is the one that bit me earlier. And the easiest way to get her attention is to just poke her with some bedding or a stick. <laughs> She's not that mean, but she is a grouch. And she will actually take this inside the barrel and eat it if I... I'm trying to get her to take it. So I pull it away from her and she just has this, usually this urge to take it out of my dish. Okay, it's going, it's going, it's going, it's going. Do you want it or not? Come on. Hey, I'm not holding it for you while you eat it. There you go. That's your problem. So I usually leave the dish and that's one of the reasons I bought these dishes because they're made of glass so I don't have to worry about them. Um, Chewing it to smithereens. Um, okay, the next two two piece. Let's see where everyone is. Oh, one person's in here. I like doing this. I think this is really cute. Um, if I can get someone to stick their heads out of that window, that would be fantastic. Come on, baby. Come on. I know it's hard to see with the glare, but, um, he doesn't like strawberry. I can't hold it, that's the problem. <laughs> Alright, and then the next grouch of the day, because she's kind of a grouch, too. Um, but she, she's pretty good. She's pretty snappy, usually, when it comes to food. Uh, she'll just, you know, grab and go, but in this case... Everybody seems to want to eat the strawberry while I'm holding it. Well, I'm not going to do that. I'm sorry. I got better things to do. So she's just going to eat it there. And I don't mind. See, that's the best thing about this bedding. Uh, because it's so cheap, I can just take a handful and just toss it in the wash. I mean, I don't have to worry about it. It's not like Carefresh where I'm worried the food's going to go stale and pick through the bedding and all that jazz. Okay, let's go with the Robos because uh, I'm running out of time on this video. Um... And they are not hard to film because they don't do much. Uh, they will not eat out of my hand. These guys could not care less. It doesn't matter what I'm offering. So um, all I can do is just attract them and let them know that it's there. Well, they would know anyway. Um, so Sniffles has not been very interested in eating either. So I'll just put it there. Um, Nibbles, on the other hand, has been like a eating machine. So she's probably going to take it anyway. Wakey, wakey, Sleeping Beauty. Come on, Sleeping Beauty. Would you like some strawberry? There you go. See, that's what I was looking for. And then uh, you should just let them eat in peace. I know. I'm sorry, guys. But uh, And then if I do manage to successfully give it to them, I take the dish with me. But that also leaves a problem. Sometimes I am... Um, I forget which ones I took them from, and then at the end of the day, I'm looking for dishes because uh, their next snack will be usually around 9. If I go to work the next day, usually maybe 6, 7, 8 o'clock in there, somewhere, most times. Uh, so their next one will be with cheese. Um, this morning, they had cucumbers already. So, But like I said, this is what I mean by little servings. Um, so, yeah, just wanted to let you know. Isn't that fun? I'm all done. I gotta just take away the plate now. <laughs> I had that fall in their habitat one time. Uh, don't ask me how. <laughs> it just did. It made a big kerplunk. I was so worried I squashed my hamsters. Alright, that's all.